But the first real king of leg spin googly bowling was little Arthur Maley, the former glassblower from Sydney, who spun the ball prodigiously. Accuracy may not have been a strong point, but jovial persistence was, and with a keen brain and the bravery needed by all slow bowlers under fire, he diddled out the best batsmen Australia and England could send to the crease. He was the first to take nine wickets in a test innings, and in the 1921 tour of England, he took all 10 Gloucestershire wickets for 66. In contrast, in a Sheffield Shield match at Melbourne five years later, his analysis in Victoria's innings of 1107 was four for 362. His figures could have been better, he said, if a chap in a tweed coat had held on to a couple of catches in the shilling enclosure. I had this ball painted half white, Jack, so that he might see it spinning better. Here's the leg break in slow motion. As the ball leaves the hand, a spin is given, which makes it break to the left. Arthur Maley, a wicket taker who never deliberately bowled the maiden over. <laughs>